King of Dreamland, check. King of the Koopas, check. King of the fucking idiots, check. You see, we've played a lot of kings here during the course of this series, but there still remains one that we have not yet touched upon. You all know exactly who I'm talking about, that is right, the King of Darkness himself, Ganondorf. And also, you know, the hero king, Marth, I guess, if you, you know, want to be anal about it. But we're not trying to talk about anime today. Instead, we're finally going to sit down and have a nice chat about Captain Falcon's long-lost puke green brother. So without further delay, grab your nearest child, drag him down into the pits of hell, Game. and let's begin. There is a lot of complex tech when it comes to playing Ganondorf. Is what I would say if there was literally any complex tech when it comes to playing Ganondorf. It isn't for no reason why he's in literal garbage tier, because his skill ceiling basically boils down to how well you can move the C stick and how many times your dumb shit opponent will just walk directly into you. But here at good ol' Ouija Plays, we say fuck you to tier lists. The only tiers I'm concerned about are the ones I cry myself to sleep with. This is for glory, baby! Ganondorf is just as viable here as this bitch right here here is in the actual game. Like, seriously though, do you really think that this Zero Suit Samus isn't going to die by just jumping into one of my smash attacks? I mean, have you learned nothing throughout this series? Sure, against good players, you're hopelessly outclassed due to the simple fact that you and your attacks are as slow as a fucking slug, but in For Glory, where every one of your opponent's brains moves as slow as a fucking slug, Ganondorf is fantastic. Just take a gander at this goddamn villager over here. Like, I don't even think that this is a real person that I'm going up against right now, truthfully. I am 99% sure that this is, this, this is just a rat, like, walking back and forth on a gamepad. I mean... Uh, th there is no other explanation for this level of terribleness. The rat just doesn't know what to do. Like, I, I just keep pressing the same buttons over and over again, and the, the rat just doesn't know. This is how it's done, ladies and gentlemen. This right here, this is the epitome of Ganondorf gameplay. Let us all take a moment to clasp our hands together and pray that this rat player will one day develop even a tiny bit of skill for this game. Because as of right now, things are not looking too good. Can somebody please explain to me why people go to For Glory, pick a character and everything, right? And then just immediately go AFK. Like, does the mere sight of the King of Darkness drive these players to take a fucking hammer to their controllers or something out of fear? This happens way too much, and I just... I don't... PSA time, kids. If you do this, then here's a tip from me to you. Don't do this. You're welcome. While the constant side B spam is a great technique, make sure to mix it up a little bit by also constantly spamming your incredibly powerful smash attacks. Boom! Now that right there, folks, is a true zero to death combo. Let's just do that one more time and... Oh no, oh, oh, ooh, ooh, do you feel that? Oh, my kidneys, oh, my kidneys can't handle all of the salt coming off of this Pac-Man right now. Oh, my kidneys are failing, I'm, I'm, I'm dead, I'm just dead. I'm dead and the Pac-Man salt killed me. Thank you, Pac-Man. You know, really the best thing you can do against Cloud is to just drop him and yourself down to one stock as soon as possible. This way the game will be over quicker, meaning that you can stop playing against Cloud quicker, which is a definite win in my book. So this is the power of For Glory. Whoa. Mm-hmm. So, uh, cloud players, huh? They, they sure aren't complete fucking degenerates, are they? Oh, 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 darn. Oh, dang. Look, I've, I've been truly outskilled. I... Round of applause. Round of applause, everybody, for this, uh, outstanding player. W way to go, Cloud. You, you are the best guy. I wish I was you. All right, boys, let's end this game in style. You see this yokai over here? Because you're not going to see him for much longer. Watch this right here. Warlock! Punch! God damn it, man. Just... 
just a tad early. And if only For Glory wasn't such a laggy, unstable cancer fest, then maybe I could actually land some of these. Of course, I could always just grab a friend and stage a clip like that, as some Smash YouTubers do. But I actually respect all of you enough to not blatantly lie right to your fucking faces like a complete and utter douchebag. He's a slippery one, this Mewtwo, let me tell ya! Sliding all over the place like this stage is just one big goddamn slip and slide? Wait a minute. He's Shadow Mewtwo. Shadows are dark. I'm the king of darkness. Mewtwo, your king commands that you kill yourself at once! Well, I guess being a king certainly has its perks.